Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. So yes, uh, this was the recently released Gold Rathian and we're gonna do a quick video the same fashion we did the Basil one so we can have and talk a little bit about what they brings. So I just beat the Gold Rathian and I got the, uh, the her armor and then it has two new skills, completely new to uh, to Sunbreak included in these skills and also it has one, two, three, four five six seven eight nine ten skills ten active skills on it which is kind of cool actually so it brings a, stra a status trigger which is a new skill two fluoride chain creed three points and then full defiance defiance is kind of cool we'll talk about a little bit of both those of those skills uh, in a bit now counter strike two points divine blessing full uh, we have critical boost and then we have what is the peak performance full a bay window recovery up the bay window actually works well with the with the status trigger uh but it's it, it's kind of cool and it works better on things that need to uh to like uh, evade through things instead of uh, guard so it doesn't work on guard anyways let's take a look at the at the at the and the at the two skills by itself so it says here status trigger perform a perfectly timed evade as the monster attacks to trigger a, a normal status build up so it increases your build up and it's time based so while effect uh, so level one gives you a duration of five seconds level two gives you a duration of eight seconds and level three seems to be worth it because it's a uh, level three up to 12 seconds it's the the largest one from one to three either you use one or three level two seems okay but uh, i mean it all depends on what you have uh, on thing uh good good enough good enough they actually paired it with two points of fraud on fluoride which is uh 10 attack power 10 10 uh attack power and two point and, uh, and 10 affinity which if you can complete the third one this will be kind of insane right uh, that's awesome now the next uh, the next skill that it has is defiance and defiance the simplest way I can explain to you, uh, what it is it's a um, uh, agitator for defense right it has five points and it uh, increases defense when large monsters become enraged so while the monster is in range, you get some sort of earplugs, some sort of wind protection, and some sort of tremor protection. And then on at least on level one, level two increases the protections of those, more earplugs, more tremors, more uh, more wind pressure, and also it gives you five defense. Level three, the same. Uh, this time it includes strong roars plus 10 defense level 4 nullify weak and strong roars wind and tremors reduce the powerful roars and then dragon wind and plus 20 defense plus 20 defense a bunch level 5 it's full earplugs i believe which is nullified weak strong powerful roars wind and dragon wind and then tremors and and 30 points of defense so if you haven't found problem with Kruchala, you can take this <laughs> you can take this right uh, that's kind of cool i love that the, they included a skill like this it's like the same for agitator so you're getting defense while you're getting ag uh, agitator uh it could be it could work the other way i mean you can maybe you can play with agitator itself and see how it, everything works but man it's kind of crazy uh to boot they have counter attack divine blessing for protection one point of critical boost we have peak performance and we have a bay window to help with the status trigger and then a recovery it's kind of hard to to do it with the with the lens but it triggers only on hops not on blocks right i don't know if it triggers with the insta block but it needs to be a bait it seems like it needs to be a bait so that's the trigger just a bait but for things that kind of bait i saw some information it says that the bow actually triggers it when you do an abate uh, an abate thing and hit it which is kind of cool this will be kind of insane right status trigger uh for for thing then flora and chain crit and then just stack on i guess blast and paralysis man that would be crazy right or poison and paralysis something that you can actually maintain uh anyways 
Yeah, I want to take a quick... That's a quick look. Let's check the piece by piece, right? Piece by piece, we have the helm. The helm has two level tools, which is great space. And then for two status trigger, Flori and crane shit. This piece alone makes your build, dude. Look at that. If you're working with those three, this piece alone makes your build. That's really good. Let's move to the mail. The mail has a level three and a level two and full divine blessing. So if you're time pro surviving, here it is, divine blessing and defiance. Great piece for the fe for defense, right? Uh, it starts at 120, right? Which is a little bit more than uh, base of 123. But hey, it looks great. Next piece is the Lo Luna Bracers. Level, great space, level four, level two, and level one. And critical boost, peak performance, quick chain. This is a part that you can leave out, right? This is a part that you can leave out to mix. This is a part that you can leave out if you want it. If you have something with better space, I doubt it because this space is insane. But this is the part that you can leave out. Okay, next part, the coil. The coil brings us a point of status, uh, status trigger to complete it. Flori, one point, a bay window. Okay, so uh, this is a pretty decent part too. If you didn't want it ahead for some reason, this will make part of your build work. But I'm paying if you do, if you're hitting something that hit that much, might as well use Creek Chain, right? Uh, look at that. For the space, a level three and a level two. It's not too bad either. That can easily accommodate uh, offensive gar and uh, wex, or you can accommodate, I guess, gar uh, and wex. You can accommodate uh, handicraft, right? Things like that. Anyways, the last part is the Lunagaron, Lunagaron, Golden Loon Graves, and it's a level four and a level three. Interesting, right? And this one is the it's one of the most protective ones, right? Recovery up, three points of defiance, and then peak performance. To tell you the truth, if you want, look, you can do pa 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 and you have a great thing. What do we have here? Defiance. We have uh, we have a survival thing. Full defiance, critical boost, divine blessing, offensive guard with the things I have. I lost a couple of things, but man. This is solid, right? Solid, solid if I want it to be some defensive, right? One of them. The other example is you can forego that and do that, dude. And that is the head. You got, I still have my guard because I have guard up, but um, look at that. You got the two status triggers, either that or or you can even go with the skirt. skirt. You get two fluoride out of it, right? Two Flory, two Great Chain, and two and full status trigger. That's and the space is not too bad either. You have five points of space, really big, really big. Um, if you if you really want to change, finish, meant, and then get the other two. Try to try try to look for slots to uh, point the the weapon or whatever you need for your weapon on those two great great pieces of equipment i love them um i'm glad that it's here and you know what it's great i can see future builds with it survival builds are a great thing with this right that and maybe mixing it with the Krushala's thing it'll be kind of insane i'm gonna keep it short and simple because this just came out man this was fantastic anyways you should check it out it's a great fight we're gonna point on uh, we're gonna probably put the fight link in the screen right now so if you haven't watched it it's my first time finding it go ahead and watch it enjoy that anyways thank you everyone for watching we'll see you next time bye